YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you my AI customer success manager and I haven't seen another video like this on YouTube before so I could be the first person to create something like this and how it works is whenever my customers fill out this onboarding form with their first name, email, who they're looking to help and they're often just some other questions about their business, within 60 seconds, it's actually going to create them a custom personalized 90 day scaling plan. But the best part about this is it's 100% automated. So it runs 24 seven, 365 days of the year without me doing anything. And it uses my voice to give them the plan. So it tells them exactly what they need to execute on each day. It gives them value. And it's just amazing for generating your clients and customers amazing results without you having to do anything. So just to listen to this, if we quickly let Hi, it run. Sam, I'm Charlie's assistant. And so let's just skip on this. So obviously it bases the plan off the answers that it gives us from this form. So if we just go to the daily actions. Here are your daily non-negotiable actions. Make 50 cold calls to local businesses in the real estate niche. Send 30 direct messages to followers of top real estate influencers. How this is different to anything you've seen before is it actually gives them key performance indicators for what they should be hitting as metrics based on these 50 cold calls or based off the DMs. And it even tells them how to find leads specific to the answers that they give us. So it's completely personalized and it's amazing. Obviously, you can prompt it however you want. Um, but yeah, I've just found this to be really effective for generating our clients' results. And if you look at my Instagram, I've posted hundreds of case studies. You can see Enzo today, one hour ago. Um, you know, he got a 10K pay in full, um, which is amazing. Joshua signed his first client within seven days of joining my community. And that was a 1K client. Um, you know, bookings for Jarrell. Like, you, you get the point, right? We're really good at what we do. And we've dialed this in. So whenever someone joins my community, we literally make them fill out this form to be able to give them their 90 day scaling plan, which then they post into the community. And then I do an audit, a review of it to make sure it aligns with their goals. But without further ado, let me just show you how to build this for your um, specific program. Or if you're a coach or if you're a community owner, this would be amazing. Um, so it's actually really easy. It should take like 10, 15 minutes and it's really effective. So let's dive straight into it. The first thing we're gonna do is head over to a tool called Tali. Now, this is where we're going to be creating the form. And I've tried Typeform. I've tried other form hosting platforms. I've just found this to be the best. And it's completely free. And it looks the best. Like, if you actually look at the form, it looks like a Google Doc. I don't know why, but it's, like, super clean and aesthetic. So we can just call this, like, onboarding form. Or whatever you want to call it. I mean, it's really up to you. You can obviously add a cover, add your logo. You can make it look way better than this. Add a few emojis to spice it up. Um, we can then basically add a few questions. So click on add, short answer. Obviously, we need their first name. So what's your first name? We can add another one. Um, accidentally deleted that, <laughs> my bad. Um, we can add another one. Let's say, what's your email? So these are just the first two questions that I would obviously answer because we need that email because that's where we actually send the results to within like 60 seconds. And obviously, it's automated. So um, what's your email? And then from this point on, I recommend having like 10 to 15 questions. Obviously, the more questions, the more specific of an answer we can give. Um, but obviously, the prompt is what generates the amazing plan. So yeah, you can obviously play around with this, design it how you want, make it look good. And once you've created your form, we are then going to head over to make.com to actually build the automation. Now, the beautiful thing about Make is it's completely free. You don't need to put your card in and you can stay on the plan for as long as you want. So I'm actually saving you a ton of money because Tile is free, Make is free, everything is free when you watch my videos. Um, so just quickly log in to Make and you can watch this as you build it just because it will make more sense. So you can follow as you go is, trying to what, I'm, is what I'm trying to say. But once you log in, um, let me just refresh this. Okay, here it goes. Um, we're going to create a new scenario at the top right. And this is just creating a new workflow. So the first thing we're going to do is add a trigger. Now, a trigger is what starts the automation. So we're going to search for Tali because that's obviously the form. And we're going to click on watch new responses. So whenever someone fills out the form that you've created, it's actually going to um, start the trigger. So just click on add right here. And you want to select the form that you've actually um, created. So let's just say it's this one. Yeah, like that's the one I've created earlier. Click on save and then click on OK. Perfect. So you've started the trigger. Next is going to be chat GPT. So this is really simple, but you're going to do message and assistant. So now what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to head to OpenAI assistant 
and you're going to need to create an assistant. Now, this is what determines how good your plan will be for your clients or customers. So what you need to do is you actually need to call this whatever you want. So let's just call it like, um, I don't know, uh, success manager. And for the instructions, you need to prompt this heavy. So let's say you are a fitness coach and you... Um, want to provide this as a lead magnet which you can very easily do you could create a i don't know a 90 day weight loss plan by using this like form essentially and the uh, automation that we're using right here so you just need to prompt it with like how they're going to lose weight so obviously the more information you give ChatGPT, the better answer it's going to do for your uh, customers so obviously you want to prompt this hard and then once you've done that um you can then actually head over to i believe um api keys and create a new secret key call it whatever you want and then just create a new secret key and you'll get an api key and then that's really important because then in make you then just need to add it right here basically and just select the organization so once you've done that now we've linked openai to make.com which is amazing that's what we want so once you've done that for the assistant obviously you can just use for one. So you can so you basically just select the assistant that you've created. And then for role, you can select a uh, user, I believe. Message, this is really important. So what I've done in my prompt, I'm not gonna show you my entire prompt because obviously it's um, private to everyone that joins my community. So if you, um, yeah, look at this, whenever someone joins my community, we actually, um, yeah, get them to fill it in here. And obviously, you know, it just works like a charm. So. If we go back to um, to here, obviously what you want to do is you want to create something like this. So you're telling it to use this information to build a custom 90 day scaling plan. You can obviously have this for whatever you want. It doesn't have to be 90 day scaling plan. It could be like um, help them solve this problem or build them like a, I don't know, a fitness roadmap or uh, I don't know, wh 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 wherever you're selling, you can get creative with this. But you basically just want to say this and then just like input all of the fields. Um, so you can do this by just, yeah, like, obviously um just plopping in all this information so this is the answer that is going to be specific for each of them so yeah you can see that's that and then if we just tell it to like um based off their answers create them a custom i don't know let's say 30 day plan to scale their business and then obviously you want to prompt it way more. So I say something like this, do not include anything that isn't the actual plan. Uh, no hashtag or no um, star or like apostrophe um, in the output, so in the response, and then keep the plan similar to the format. So you want to give it a format. So you can see, for example, um, we say something like hi, and then their first name, I'm Charlie's assistant. He's informed me that you need a killer 90 day scaling plan um, based off the um, answer you've given me. So this will help you. Yeah, so you can obviously just do it. Tell them how you want to structure the plan. Obviously, you get the point. You can make it like way more in-depth. But obviously, we need to give it information. So if they respond, and let's say they help like lawyers, we need to make sure that in our plan, we tell them like if they are doing in-person businesses, then we need to make sure that they do like, they go into like Facebook groups because that's where like lawyers would hang out or um, cold calls um do quality dms document their journey and so forth so the we, you can see how long this is i'm not going to show you the entire plan but you can really make this like in depth and obviously that would give like way better output so it's going to do a bit of trial and error but that's how that works uh, now we are going to use 11 labs you don't have to use 11 labs you can just have it send an email with their plan um however i wanted to go an extra mile and just add my voice telling them what to do um so you would head over to 11 labs speech synthesis um you would then go to uh voiceover studio and also oh, no, it would be i think voices oh yeah voices add a new voice instant voice cloning and then just record yourself speaking for five seconds and then you'll get your own voice so once you've done that we can then head over to make and we can search for 11 labs so you want to do create a speech synthesis Obviously, add your API key by going down here to the bottom and um, profile an API key. And then you get your API key. You copy that into uh, this part, I believe. 
Oop, didn't mean to click on that. And then for the model, so for the voice, obviously you want to select your voice. For the model, I just go for like this one. It's really up to you. You can go for the turbo one. That's also good. For the text, the results, I believe. So content, text, and then it would be like results. So put result um, and then keep that the same. So perfect. So now how this works is whenever someone submits a form, we are going to run it by our assistant that's going to create them the 90 day scaling plan. And then it's going to actually speak the 90 day scaling plan using your voice. And now we are almost done. You just need to click on Google Drive and you need to, if we go here, you basically need to create a folder. So click on Google Drive, create a folder. For this, you can actually select the right one. So select the drive you want then just choose the folder location this does not matter you can put anything for this let's just do like more short form and then for the folder's name just call it like i don't know file name once again this doesn't really matter click ok now we need to um i believe upload so let's click on google drive and let's do upload a file and what you're going to do is you're going to um folder id you're just going to select folder id and then you're going to click ok i believe I believe it's just a bug. If we click on OK, you can see it's fixed. Um, and now you're going to, I believe it's share, get a share link. So get a share link. And what you're going to do is you're going to choose a drive, my drive, file. Yeah, you want that. File ID, just select file ID. Uh, role is going to be, I believe, reader, user is anyone. And then click OK. So now, you are pretty much done because how this works is, and we'll test it in a second, but whenever someone submits a form, it's going to go to ChatGPT to be able to write the prompt. Or sorry, not, not write the prompts, but it's going to write an answer based off our prompt. It's then going to go through 11 labs and spe uh, speak the you know, plan. It's then going to upload that to Google Drive. And now finally, we need to send an email. So to send an email, I recommend you, so once you click on send an email, I highly recommend you use your domain to actually send the email, not a Gmail. Because if you do a Gmail, you basically need to go to the admin console and it's a way to, it's way too confusing. Like you can go through the process if you want. Um, you can actually click on this guide and example, um, but you can use this to actually connect. It's, pretty, it's not that complicated, but it's just an extra step that I would just, if you have a domain, just send through that. And then for recipient, um, obviously we want to go down to the bottom and we want to click on your email. So this is going to send to their email each time. And for the subject line, we can say something like uh, custom plan four. And then obviously you want a personalized subject line. So we're going to put like their name. And for content, um, we are then going to put the output of the Google Drive. So if we go up here, you can see that we should have a um, a web content link. So this is basically a shareable link and you obviously want to make sure it's in an email format. So we can say something like, Hey, and then let's just grab their first name. So, Hey, let's say Charlie. Um, thanks for filling out the form. Here's your, uh, custom plan. Please take notes and listen to it carefully enjoy and let me know if you need anything else perfect so now you can just click okay and just like that you've created the automation so now we can actually have some fun and test this so what you're going to need to do is you're going to click on immediately as data arrives so this is going to constantly uh, be running in the background even when you have your laptop off or computer off it's going to be um, just in the cloud working and, you know, sending your voice as a plan to customers. So it's 24 seven, like what I said, just make sure you have the scheduling turned on. And once you've done this, you're good to go. So let's just save this and we can quickly test this. Obviously the output isn't going to be as good because I didn't have time to prompt it fully. Um, so obviously make sure you prompt it like how I've done in this one, for example, you can see that I've like fully prompted it out to the max with like, I don't know, maybe a thousand words or so. Um, so you may, you just need to con continuously test it. Um, so if we go to, uh, let's go to here, we, we can just test it and see if it doesn't output. 
So if we quickly fill out this form, let's just do, I don't know, Charlie. They were looking to help, um, I don't know, let's do lawyers. Well, let, yeah, we can keep it lawyers. Let's say our is Google Ads, our service is Google Ads. Let's say we're extroverted, zero clients. Let's just say this, uh, biggest constraint sales or appointment setting. Let's say the goal is 50K a month. Click submit. It should now, um, you can see that it has. So obviously I said my name was Charlie and I said, I was working in the lawying, uh, lawyer um, niche. So if we listen to this. Hi, Charlie. I'm Charlie's assistant, and he's informed me that you need a killer 90-day scaling plan based off the answers you've given me. So this will help you a lot and provide clarity in your daily actions. Please take notes as this is important stuff. Here are your daily non-negotiable actions. Make 50 cold calls to local businesses. Aim for a 30% pickup rate, 15% offer present rate, 5% appointment booking rate. Send 50 DMs on Facebook to business owners in your niche. Target a 15% first reply rate, 5% offer reply rate. Document your journey on YouTube daily, creating a series like Building in Public. Aim for a 5% click-through rate, three-minute watch time. It's absolutely crucial to track metrics each day, as this allows you to solve. It's perfect. Obviously, I'm not going to show the rest because that's you know, valuable and private to the members in my community. And on that note, if you do want this automation completely built for you, feel free to just join my community because, yeah, like you get everything. I'm not even joking. You literally get like all the automations. Um, you get free goal level, goal level snapshots, and you can speak to me one to one in the DM. So I, I don't see why you wouldn't join this. You get like a ton of other make automations where you can very easily just click like import because I give you the blueprint. So, yeah, that's that. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like, subscribe. I'll catch you in the next video and have an amazing day.